is the end of the study. Now to try to remove a very hard stuck star. <laughs> Loma right. Linda is doing a pioneer study on how to remove a... Well, one arm was easy. A Orcaeus star starfish. They're trying to lift them off huh, without tearing any of these yeah. little. Yeah. Uh, these guys are no joke. Stuck on there good, huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think from now on I'm just gonna yank them because I'm already, he's already losing some podia even with this. The podium is that that little, uh, yeah, it's that, uh, the, the little fingers on their thing. Yeah. Right? Well, there are legs, but the whole arm doesn't come off, right? No, no, no. It's just a little podium. Yeah, it's the little tube feet. Come to Loma Linda <laughs> and learn how to work the marine creatures in our lab. <laughs> late at night. The grad students are doing late at night over here. Wrestling with starfish. They grow those little podia back, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just don't like, you know, it probably stresses them out and they probably use a lot of energy. We, uh, re having to resynthesize all these. can't leave him in there, right? No. Yeah, he has to come out. Yep. Because this is the feeding area only. Mm-hmm. Is this one your batch of nine or one of the older stars? Uh, this is one of the older stars. minutes of this battle with this guy. Yep. Yep. So every night you gotta go or every twice a week, three times a week you gotta go through this? Uh nine times a week. <laughs> nine times a week. 
but I um, I usually just pull them right off this time since he was so stuck or it seemed like he was stuck really hard I, I wanted to do it slowly but I noticed that with that one arm that I just pulled really quickly it came right off so I'm not gonna do this anymore because this poor guy is you know stressing him out for too long and See the bottom of him. I put him on the film. So that's him just pulled off. Mm -hmm. okay. wow. That was about five minutes, a little over five minutes of trying to take this guy off. So he goes in and goes into his um, big pen over here. Huh? Yeah, which is why I have that set up. So in this setup, I never have to struggle ever to take these off. They, they are not allowed to touch the glass. Yeah. And that's a uh, coral. What is that? Crushed coral on the bottom. Yeah. Um, it's um. It looks like a coral media. Crushed. Uh, what was it? Oyster shells. Ah. So they get the rest there. They don't eat. Do they eat in here? No. I do feed them in there. That's what they're not going for the study. That's not. Yeah. Yeah. Right, they don't so eat in the study. I just have them see which. Uh, yeah. Which prey item they would prefer. So there is nine in here. Yeah. They are live rock underneath the netting. Some, they're set up. Okay, more studies at EBS Marine Lab. Full swing now. 